Would you have stayed? Yeah. I always come by this place and they've got the coolest fruit around. I don't even know what some of it is. Look like that. I'm gonna buy some. I want to buy one of these. Try it this time. I'm not so sure about that one yet. How do you pick a good one of these? How do you know that when you don't even know what it is? I think it's a dragon. You know what that's called? Hi, what's it called, man? Um, that is um, mangosteen. Mangosteen. Yeah. Are they good? I'm gonna find out, huh? They're very good. It's two years. Can you tell me what to do with it again? I yeah, you just basically you just um, brush it and open it up, and then open it up, and you can see it's uh, inside. Uh, two years. Like, uh, uh, white clovers inside. Can you eat the little clover parts? Yes. What is the thing that's out there with the little, the little hairs on them? What is that? Oh, that's um, a rambutan. It's the wild version of the little Okay, I'm going to be here for a couple days. I'm going to try one every day. Can you tell me a couple things real quick? Yeah. Okay, this guy's going to help me out here. I want to, like, I'm on six days, I'm going to try all kinds okay. of Is that just a pineapple? That's a mini pineapple, okay. yeah, exactly. This is a star fruit. Star fruit, is it sweet? It's citrus, so it's citrus. more... Citrus, so more like an orange kind of mold? Well, more like a lemon type of But it's good? It's nice, it's, it's interesting. What is that? That's a, uh, no, uh, granadilla, sorry. Like a apple or a pear or what? No, actually it has... Uh, it's really hard to explain, but it's uh, you crack it open, it has like a really sweet, watery uh, substance with seeds inside. It's like a kind of jelly. Okay, what is that? Uh, kumquats. Those, kumquats. Those are like mini, mini uh, oranges, and you eat them whole with with the skin as well. Okay. And the inside is like really sour, and the skin is like gives it a sweet contrast. So it's a sweet, bitter. That's a fig. Yeah, it's a fig, exactly. Those are tamarillos, three tomatoes. Oh, like a tomato. Extremely disgusting. I, I don't, don't like tomatoes that. anyway. You don't okay. Want yeah. Uh, a plum. What is that? That's just a plum. Yeah. Okay. There's two the, more over here. The one with the hairs. What? Is, that's dragon fruit, right? That's a dragon fruit. Yeah. This is a rambutan, so that's a wild lychee. A wild. What is that? Sweet or what? This is a lychee. You, yeah. you know these, right? No. I'll try this. Out. And this and that's like a wild version of it. I can take this one. Yeah, you can take. Oh, thank it. you. Okay. And is it like a nut inside or what? No, it's, it has like a white uh, fruit flesh. I crack it open. Nut. I crack it well, open. Well, you peel off the skin. And then you, you eat the inside. Yeah, exactly. And that's just a wild one? Yeah, and that's a wild version of that. And these are sweet or what? Yeah? Yeah. They're extremely sweet. Mango. Mango, okay. Yeah. What is that? And that's a kiwano. That's a... Kiwano? A kiwano, yeah. It's a cactus fruit from uh, Africa. Sweet? Uh, not on its own, but you do eat it with sugar though. Because then, ha then it has like a taste that resembles a bit of... Uh, a fusion between cucumber and banana. Okay, you gotta, you got uh, that. Uh, Sharon fruit. Sharon fruit? Yeah, Is Turkish. It sweet? It's extremely sweet. Extremely sweet. Yeah, but these aren't ripe yet, though. They're what? These aren't ripe yet, though. They need to be soft. This one's ripe, right? Yeah, they're that's, all right. Uh, that's a, yeah, they're all right. Yeah. yeah. And that's a cherimoya. Cherimoya? Yeah. It's uh, from South. Uh, Looks America. like an apple, kind of? No, actually, it's. Um, it's really strange because when these aren't ripe yet, because they need to be really soft. But when they're ripe, they actually uh, resemble like a kind of like a custard. A custard. Yeah, it's really it's strange. Yeah, because it's okay. it's 100% fruit, but it does uh, resemble. That's custard. not a pear, is it? A white pear? That's a Chinese pear. Actually. A Chinese. Pear. So it's a fusion between a pear okay. and apple. I'll be back tomorrow. No worries. And I'm gonna get. I think you got. I think I like that thing. The. How much is that me? expensive? Two euros. Two euros. Yeah. No, they're really okay. nice. You, they mostly actually just use it as a garment on a dish, you know. So you slice it up. That's why it's called a star fruit. Because when you slice oh, it, oh, you slice the middle, it that way, it looks star. like a star. You know? And you don't eat the skin. Yeah, you eat it all. You eat it all. Yeah.
But, like an um, apple, then you just clean it and eat it all. Yeah, yeah, exactly. But well, you can also, um, I mean, um, a lot of um, South Americans, they eat it with um, salt, actually. So it gives it like a little a bit of, uh, of a bite. Yeah. Is that cantaloupe or what is that? No, that's a guava. A guava? Yeah. Ah, cool. Thank you very much, man. You are I'll welcome. I'll be back a few times. I want to try it. That's just strawberries, right? Strawberries, exactly. Okay, man. Cheers, Thank man. you. Cheers. So, we will definitely be back at this place. Enjoy your night. Thank you, sir. And to try all the fruits. That guy was extremely nice. Helped me out. I hope you got it. I was, I'm still a little shy when filming and stuff. So, when it's on a car and it's something I don't know about, I think I, I don't even I don't want to say what the other thing is. See? If I'm not sure about it, I just do not want to say anything at all. But that's our fruit thing. And as you can see, he gave us this. I'm going to have to actually look it up. I hope he worked there. <laughs> and I'm going to have to look that up too. To remember what it was. I always got the trolleys running until like 12.30 or so. Pretty much always get somewhere. Hotels everywhere. Sex shops everywhere. Churches everywhere. I think that's actually the church hotel. Well, this camera is definitely not my next five, but it's a pretty good cha camera for the price. Uh, I'm a total Sony fan. I use a great image processor. Well, that's about it for now. I'm going to go ahead and Man, it's 10.30 at night here, 11 o'clock actually, and they're running like crazy, both ways. <laughs>